Welcome to lecture number 18 of the series Unreal 5 for ArcQuiz and in today's lecture we'll learn about the third important point you need to know if you're modeling something for Unreal Engine and that is UV Unwrap. Now I will not judge your knowledge by explaining what UV Unwrap is and believe it or not there is no other detail associated with UV Unwrapping. Whatever the software you're using just unwrap all of your objects by using the appropriate methods like cube projection, box projection or unwrapping by marking the seams and all. Just unwrap your object the way you normally do in your 3D software and you're good to go. So let's get started. First of all, I'll hide everything in my scene. And let's unhide our walls. I'll select this mesh and I'll press N to verify that my scale is applied before I unwrap anything. So let's isolate this one. Let's view the UV editor window. I'll select everything, I'll mark my seams and I'll unwrap it. Okay, let's hide this one. Now I'll select this object and let's select the sharp edges. I'll select these edges. Okay, yeah. I'll mark my seams and I'll select everything and unwrap it. Yeah, okay. I'll hide this one. I'll select this mesh. Let's isolate this one. I'll select everything and I'll mark my seams and let's unwrap it. Okay. Yeah, I'll select everything, mark the seams and I'll unwrap it. Let me disable my edge length. Let's hide this one as well. Okay, so let's select this object. I'll select everything. I'll mark my seams and I'll unwrap it. Let's select this one. Isolate this one. Select the sharp edges. And I'll mark my seams. I'll select everything and unwrap it. Okay, let's hide this one. I'll select this mesh. Select everything. Yeah, and I'll mark my seams and I'll unwrap it. Select this object. Select everything. I'll mark my seams and I'll unwrap it. Before we UV unwrap these kitchen cabinets, we need to apply the bevel modifier because these edges are way too sharp. So let's select this one. I'll go into my modifiers tab and I'll add a bevel modifier. Let's uh, change this value to 0 0.015 meters. And I'll increase my segments to... Let me first apply shade smooth. You can also select four. And I'll select other cabinets. And I'll press Ctrl L to copy my modifiers. And I'll apply all of my modifiers. Okay. Make sure that you have even number of bevels because if you have even number of bevels, it will be very easy for you to mark the seams. So I'll select these edges. I'll mark my seams, I'll select everything and I'll UV unwrap it. Yeah, okay.
okay so i've unwrapped all of these cabinets so in the next step before i unwrap all of these let's model a shelf for these cabinets i'll hide these cabinets let's go into the top view and let's bring a plane into our scene i'll snap this plane at this point yeah okay i'll go into the edit mode let's select these vertices and let's snap them at this point i'll select these vertices and i'll snap them at this point yeah okay select these vertices and let's snap them at this point i'll select these vertices and i'll snap them at this point i'll add a loop cut and let's uh, snap this loop cut at this point i'll select these two vertices and let's snap them at this point yeah okay i'll select everything and let's extrude them on z axis by 0 0.02 meters let's select these two objects i'll go into the edit mode and i'll select these vertices and let's snap them at this point now i'll select this shelf i'll isolate this one and let's select the sharp edges And I'll mark the seams, I'll select everything and I'll unwrap it. Okay. Let's move this shelf to kitchen cabinets and I'll hide this one. Let's hide everything in our scene. Let's unhide the kitchen cabinets. I'll select this object and I'll select the sharp edges. And I'll mark the seam, I'll select everything and I'll press UV and wrap. Okay, so before applying UV unwrap to this mesh, first of all, let's apply the bevel modifier. Okay, I'll type in 0 0.015 and four segments are okay. I'll select all of these and I'll select this one. I'll press Ctrl L and I'll copy my modifiers. Let's unhide our couch one and couch two. I'll select all of my basic objects for the couch and then I'll select this one. I'll press Ctrl L and I'll copy all of my modifiers. To apply the bevel modifier, let's select these objects as well. And I'll apply the bevel modifier for all of my objects. Let's hide couch 2 and couch 1.
okay so we have successfully unwrapped everything in our scene that's it for this lecture the next lecture is also a very important one because in the next lecture we'll cover the fourth and the fifth important point that you need to know if you're modeling something for unreal engine and that will be the material slots and the origin point of our objects and then the basic structure of our scene will be ready to export for unreal engine okay so i'll see you guys in the next lecture